Hi guys, I've decided to do a twin flame reading for the zodiac signs for Cancer. Oh yeah! <laughs> Alright, let's get your energy here. Alright, some outdated thinking, replaying things over in your head. Maybe some conditioning of maybe what you were told when you were younger. Maybe you were stabbed in the back quite a bit. Um, a lot of pain, separation, shocking attacks from other people that weren't warranted, I feel like. Yeah, reminiscing about that. Learning from the past, though, and making wanting to make new memories. Maybe not feeling in that energy anymore. Yeah, you're healing your heart. <clears throat> That's confirmation. You're healing your heartbreak, your heart from heartbreak, freedom from toxic relationships or addiction. I feel like it's more about self-love coming in for you here. Let's look at what your person might feel. Heartbroken, deeply hurt, sad, separated, a breakup here. So they may have just broken up with somebody here. Ah, this might be the runner. So they might be running from a codependent relationship or fear of intimacy or listening to their ego so <clears throat> this may be somebody that did this to you or just looking back at past relationships let's see cupid's arrow wow so you're healing and this person love is coming surprise an invitation or a meeting let's see clarity truth and revelation so maybe somebody was not really telling them truth about you this could have been what this was here by somebody else here that didn't want you two to come together but there's clarity now what's this ah mirroring each other so reflecting on your wounds introspection self-image and relationships reflecting all on that and i feel like this is clarity for you both i feel like you're both in each other's energy especially if this is runner chaser that is a twin flame connection here so what is their intentions and yours let's look at your intention first yeah healing family issues your love life benefits when you as you forgive your parents maybe there was some issues with your parents here cancer <laughs> more confirmation express your love go ahead and make the romantic gesture and perhaps it's just to say I love you mom and dad or something along those lines let's see about your person wow true love they see you as the love or romance of a lifetime true love they feel like you are their true love you may not see this yet let's just see here there's a lot of attraction to you so you attract romantic love by enjoying the moment fully, and this person may be very attracted to you. You may not know who this person is. They may be a secret admirer, or this is somebody from your past that this is a runner-chaser type of dynamic. Maybe you run into this person quite often, or from time to time throughout the years, and maybe you've never come together together as a couple. Maybe you've always had this person in the friend zone. Let's see. Love yourself first. Yeah, there has to be some healing here. Self-love. Your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive. And that could be the attraction here. And him feeling the true love towards you. I shouldn't say him. But I'm feeling this is masculine energy on the right. All right. I might be talking to a feminine cancer here. Let's see. What is their intention? Or your intuition telling you, sorry. Be willing to express your love, to receive love. Okay. So you may not be expecting this. What this is your intuition. This is what your intuition is telling you. Miracles and blessings. Everything has its gift. Wow. So be willing to express your love towards this person that comes in. I feel like it's going to be like a no-brainer. This is going to be like an intense connection. You're going to feel each other's energy before you actually see the person. You're going to feel them first. 
Love makes the difference. Love helps the past hurts and provides a sense of security and self-worth. Uh, see, we've been talking about self-worth here. That's kind of funny. Now, I kind of feel like these past wounds that are healing here, I kind of, what I'm getting with this cancer is something like, perhaps somebody that was in this masculine's energy may have said something that wasn't true because there was clarity about you being their true love so they may have talked about you prior to here and somebody may have talked them out of it so I feel like this love makes the difference here and this is about stability Let's see what else for him. Be in the present and dream of the future. When we dream, everything is possible. And this is stability, number four again. Yeah. Number four again. So six, four, 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 or four, 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 six. I feel like this is an uh, angel message that can be looked up to see cancer about what your angels are trying to tell you on how to proceed towards your best life and this is your love together listen with your heart you are listening but need to hear with a loving heart there you go so this has to do with number one a new beginning potential a new opportunity here for you so cancer let's find out how they feel about you and how you are feeling about them whether you know it or not this could be future um, past or present so let's see here loneliness okay so you're feeling lonely right now but you know you're never alone courage having the courage to uh, face any fears with confidence that's beautiful and maybe love is a fear for you let's see ah your heart chakra is opening and that stability in number four is coming in again what about for your person here what about your person all right sacrifice wow there's always sacrifice when you come into a relationship in order to compromise into because there's more than one person that you have to think about right and choosing wisely I feel like this person um, knows who they need to choose but maybe felt they chose wrong in the past and now they're kind of self doubts here number seven is reflecting and assessing gaining knowledge so they might be second guessing here passion is going to ignite with this new beginning opportunity and potential and wow there there may be temptations along the way so number six restoring cooperation and harmony and i feel like let's see what this temptation's about hmm maybe about an intuition maybe this is or an indecision excuse me and temptation here may be this other person trying to get them not to come forward this is somebody that's trying to keep you two from coming together what's the temptation ah there has to be some discipline here can't be any indecision and i feel like this person is having self-doubts at this point so there needs to be um some type of well they do get clarity so that might be a good indication that they need to change things here that whoever is saying things or bringing them to a different path they might need to see this what do we have here for actions wow excitement dynamite dynamite action suspense <laughs> Uh, now somebody might break up here um because there is a heartbreak here and there is healing here um this might be sudden and unexpected this is leo and this is five which is conflict instability and change and what about her side or his side 
Perfect timing. Okay. Unstoppable. Stands the test of time, past, present, or future. And this is number 10 as well. So this is, I feel like that heartbroken here is that breakup. I feel like whatever this was, this is perfect timing. This is spirit coming in and breaking you up from somebody, them up from somebody, and bringing you two together. So what is the action here? Double rainbow, divine intervention. I can't make it up here. Number seven, divine intervention. So spirit is coming in here. Number seven, they're reflecting, assessing the knowledge here. This is a divine intervention, double rainbow, ascension, like codes as above, so below. So let's see what we have for their side. Rainbow, wow. So we have double rainbow and we have rainbow. <laughs> wow. And we have cancer coming out in their own reading. Wow. So this is wish granted here. This is a payoff. This is abundance. This is good luck, patience, promise, godsend, manifesting, prosperity, perfect timing. So we have that in both sides here with the rainbow and now a double rainbow. And this is crazy because this is fruition. This is number nine. This is what's meant to happen. Spirit's bringing you two together, whether you like it or not. <laughs> wow. Develop over time. Flava, flava. Family legacy. So you two are meant to do something. This is the good stuff. This is alchemy. So you may be both alchemists that you can transmute and transform energy into love and light. Wow. You guys age well as well. <laughs> nice. So what is your true heart's desire here? What's your true heart's desire for one another here? Hmm, okay. Trust. So this is for you, Cancer. Transform occurs through acceptance. Once you accept the current situation, it will automatically transform. That's that alchemy. Passion. A magnetic and seductive quality surrounds you at the present. Enjoy it. That's that energy you're feeling from your person. This is that twin flame energy I'm getting here. For him. It's important right now to take a step back and spend time alone instead of pacing your focus on another. Now is the time to give to yourself. So this is self-love here. And I feel like you're both healing. So this is definitely important that you do. I feel like transforming and al the alchemy here, any negative energy into love and light here. Wow, this is a sacred union. Honor and treasure a relationship for it is truly sacred. I feel like when these two come together, you, Cancer, and your person, I feel like this is sacred because it is a twin flame union. Let's see one more. Let there be closeness between you, but always give each other space. Love never claims. It simply allows and gives. And I love that for you guys. Wow, you definitely are reflecting. Give each other some space at, at the moment. Trust and have faith that all will work out for the best. And this is reflecting, and I feel like this is still part of the healing. You may not come together just yet, but this is going to happen when spirit deems it, when it's at the right time. So let's look at the outside forces. I feel like it's not going to be too long from from now, we have 16, so 164 that I'm seeing here. We have 151 one, one one as well. Let's see here for outside forces for Cancer. Forgiveness, forgiving, forgiving self, forgiving whoever this person is, maybe for walking away from you. Maybe they ghosted you, or maybe you felt like they didn't want you. And there's parental care here. So somebody may be helping their parents out here. Maybe things are going, maybe someone got sick or hurt. Having to help with that. There's motivation here to forgive. 
motivation to help. A new career. So somebody might be getting a new career. This may be the way that you two meet. But this may be what happens here for you with this parental care. Perhaps you decide that you're going to go into health care or maybe you already are. Or this is just somebody is saying something to you about getting into this. But there's some motivation to forgive. And this may be with family from the past healing family issues we have decisions to make wow between the two of you when it comes to other people influencing maybe de deciding what to do what is that what what is it they don't see coming here what does cancer not see coming oh, there's going to be some mending here with number seven that's reflecting and assessing so definitely mending something here maybe with your parents could be with your twin flame let's see here ah imagine they're imagining being with you they may have always just been in the friend zone that's kind of what i'm getting right now there's this mending what's the mending Hmm, you're being a loyal heart. Maybe this is to your family. Maybe to this person. Cancer. What about your person? Ah, this is a yang. This is a masculine. So, I was picking that up on this side, and that is who they are. So, Cancer. This is a masculine here that is imagining being with you, I feel, with a new opportunity, a new beginning, a potential here. Ah, you're feeling like this person may not be for you. So what does your person feel? <laughs> Wanting to gift you things. Now, this is something you don't see coming. And this may be for a reason. Perhaps your loyal heart is not to yourself. What's the, yeah, why? Why, are, are, why is this person not for you? They're bringing stability here. So let's look at what the lesson is. Maybe there was a lesson that wasn't learned here or that needs to be learned here before you can come together. What's the lesson before you decide not to take this person? You may have money. You're in an indecision here. Number six and the number eight. So that is action and resolution. But with the six, that's restoring and cooperation and harmony. And you kind of know which road to go down. What about your person? What's the lesson here? You might be just being stubborn, Cancer, from going down the road you know you're meant to go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, let's just go back a little bit. Rewind. Okay, for your person. Ah, somebody's envying their journey here. I feel like there's envy because this person wants you and I feel like this is somebody they may have been with this may be just a friend now but this is somebody in your masculine's energy that is envious of you and I kind of felt that temptation over here I still feel like this person this lesson that he needs to learn is this person needs to be um, let go of from their energy whether it's a friend or an ex or somebody they still talk to, they have to let go of that person. Yeah, because there's the door to romance here. And I feel like you are waiting for them to learn a lesson about this person. And I feel like you, you may not feel they're for you because they're not getting it in here. And I feel like you've already got the knowledge here. And they need to figure it out. And I feel like you're you're not going to go with them until they've figured out this lesson. What's this why? Treasure Island. 
they need to know that you're the treasure and i i feel like <laughs> maybe you even told this person that they're making a mistake of some sort they needed to see this person for who they truly were or something along those lines let's look at what spirit wants to tell you to for your advice what spirit's advice clear audience so you, this door to spirit i feel like um i feel like this is you like you you definitely have You have gifts here. You can hear or notice loving guidance that you hear inside your mind or from other people. I kind of feel like you may even hear passed over loved ones that are passed over and you know this. Career transition. Your life purpose is triggering a blessed career change. And I saw that already, right? Career changes over here for your person when it comes to parental care. So this may be how you meet your person. You might be seeing your parents at a care facility or at the hospital, and this is a new career for your person that they're getting into. And maybe this is how you meet up again, because I feel like this is not the first time you've met. This may be somebody, like I said, that was in your friend zone. So let's see, they are definitely career transition. You need to take your power back, use your God-given power and intention to manifest your blessings in your life. And I feel like you may even be wanting somebody new because they're not getting it. And I feel like this may change. You might be delightfully surprised. Yeah, everything is how it needs to be right now. This person needs to look past the illusions and see the underlining order. So I feel like they're going to get it and Spirit's going to make sure they get it. Because this is something that's divine timing. This is divinely orchestrated and Spirit is intervening here. Divine intervention, so... And we have life review. Take inventory of your life and resolve to change or heal anything that is unbalanced. And I feel like that is exactly what spirit is going to make this person do. Your twin flame. They're definitely going to um, realize something about their person they have in their energy that is envious here of you, Cancer. All right. What is the outcome? For you, yes, you're on your pathway, or you're going to be if you haven't been already. Let's see, and that's number eight. That is action. Wow, and we have an official person here. 22, this is Ascended Masters. This person may end up being in a new career where they are an official person, perhaps law enforcement, lawyer, maybe they come to the hospital where you are with your parents or whatever the case is, to, and this is how you meet. Perhaps they go into law enforcement and they used to be in the medical field or, <laughs> you know, they change careers. So this is interesting. Let's see. Wow, courtship. So somebody, they're definitely going to court you. They're in high honor, or they see you as in high honor. They feel honored to be with you, perhaps. Let's see, what's the bottom of the deck? Family room, yeah. It's empty, and you may not have anyone right now. They could be um, being taken care of, or you're forgiving them. Whatever the case is, maybe you guys haven't cleared everything up in family issues here because healing family issues is a part of this and there's growth here let's cut the deck here oh, and the main female okay and this could be your family that we're talking about let's cut the deck one more time wow unexpected income is here so wow 
this is beautiful because I feel like you two will come together and when you get that unexpected income and that could be when this courtship comes in so wow let's look at whether these are blessings or challenges here for you wow you're very you're very comfortable as you are like the nine of cups is somebody that's kind of satisfied, um, wishes are being fulfilled, there's success, content, you have some sense of achievement here, a sense of well-being. So you've definitely healed by this time. This is a blessing, I would say. And what about your person? That one wanted to come. Wow. I feel like the blessing here is an opportunity together to build something here with the pentacle this is a financial career or an opportunity towards abundance being having resources and manifestations the path is clear here for this to to happen once you to have court once you're starting to court each other yeah, there's definitely clear boundaries here, I'm feeling, without a doubt. And usually this one was you, this one was your person. Because I felt you on this side, them on this side. So let's see here. What's the after tarot for all this? The blessing and or challenges and I feel like these are blessings coming in for you and this person yeah the wheel of fortune is turning in your favor <laughs> what about your person yeah they're putting an end to this deception from this person they're putting that to bed I love it that's the only way this blessing would come in is if they realized what this other person was trying to do here yeah, look at that. You're both using your intuition on this. I feel like finally there is a reasoning here or the intuition of you two actually being able to come together without any issues from anyone else and you'll be able to really have a beautiful, beautiful love relationship here. Look at this. This is a blessing. This is spirit bringing a blessing in here. This is so wonderful. I want to crack the deck on that. Yeah, you're standing above the rest here when it comes to anyone else trying to get in on this um, beautiful union. You have a position of advantage when it comes to this. <laughs> well, your person does, so <laughs> this is awesome. All right, you guys, for Cancer, this is what I have for you. I hope you enjoyed your love reading. Please like, share, and subscribe. Become part of the tribe if you haven't done so already. Don't forget to like me, and we will see you all next time. Stay blessed. All right, later.